What's up, everybody? You know, I um, I don't have my regular camera with me right now, or I'd be filming on it, but I had to just take a quick shot of this with my phone. That's a 2010 Ford Explorer Sport Track, but um, what's really unique about it is I've never seen a Sport Track look so sporty. I mean, look at that thing. Bright red. Um, it's got the fog lights. It's got the alloy wheels. Unfortunately, um, it's not one that we're selling out here at our dealership. But a customer stopped by to let us take a look at it. My God, it is good looking. I mean, it really is. Ford, you know, I wish they would have kept the sport track around and, uh, and kept on making them. I mean, just a very unique vehicle. Um, and just look at it, guys. It's really pretty. Anyways, it's got this, uh, whatever this package is on here. And uh, it's got all the chrome on it, the tunnel cover. Again, you know, when Chevrolet started making them back in the day with the uh, the avalanches, I think Ford was doing a good job, but uh, it says 207,000 miles on it with a 4.0 V6. But look at the inside of it, guys and girls. I mean, you got the red interior. Wow, we. I mean, this is really something special, man. This thing is sporty looking. Got the sunroof up top. Again, I apologize for the crappy video quality here, but um, it's being sold over there at the Mama's Used Cars off of Savannah Highway. But I just had to show it to you. That is a really good looking vehicle right there. 2010 Ford Explorer Sport Track. Man, that thing is something special, isn't it? So uh, you might be wondering, well, you know, what is the price that that dealership is trying to get for that car, right? The man told me, he said, he said they actually asking 119 for it. And he said he got them down to $8,500 cash. Man, 119 seems like a lot of money for a 2010 with over 200,000 miles on it, but maybe not. You know, maybe that's something really special there. I don't know. I'd have to go look it up online and see what the Kelly Blue Book is on it. But I think if he's got them down to 8,500 bucks, he might got himself a deal. Anyways, guys, let me know what you think. Have you ever owned one of these before? Do you think Ford should keep around the sport tracks or maybe come out with a, uh, a sport track again one day? Let us know. I'm really interested in seeing what some of y'all got to say. And I don't know uh, what y'all know, but I know one damn thing. That is a good looking vehicle right there. All right, everybody, we'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Again, just a quick short clip here on Charleston Car Videos today at the car store.